What driver? Oh, we're checking it? Yeah. yeah. Finally got a chance where YouTube didn't disrupt anything because we are waiting for it to dry. It's a terrible day. So everyone is manning their stations. Really? Things are running smooth. The moisture's right. Our high school help finally showed up. The bales are all within the range we want, about a 45 pound bale. Uh, both the barrens are running smooth. We raked part of the field the opposite way through a waterway. And I just got done baling all that because it was clumpy and everything. I wanted to make sure we didn't plug the baler. That's all good. All five balers are rolling. I'm gonna hop in the telehandler. Justin's in the jitney. We're consolidating. And we're gonna start getting this beautiful stuff home. I mean, this is some phenomenal hay. This is, days like this make the farm some money. Uh, the very, very nice stuff happening here. Well, things are running extremely well. We're several thousand bales in. We sent a couple of trailers out. Got a little bit of time. I actually caught the bundlers and the trailers. Uh, so I'm gonna film. We have are really hammering. Right now two barons are pretty much staying right in line with five balers. So that is really something. Jake is in the jitney consolidating three bundles together and I consolidate when we fall behind. I have been told by Robbie that their ground speed is 11 to 12 miles an hour which is absolutely insane. Very beautiful orchard alfalfa mix. Nice, tight, great bales. That's really phenomenal stuff. I'm gonna see if I can jump on top of the bear and uh, get some photographs while I'm on top of there. Oh, it's about to kick out here. It's nice and tight. After the 19th, 20th, and 21st bales are injected into the chamber, the hay is squeezed between a large front plunger and a closed back gate, and the four raspy knotter system ties obviously four strings around a tightly compacted bundle. On the front of the machine, you can see you have a conveyor belt pickup with two side rollers that gently feed the hay up onto a continuously rotating platform. The spacer bar is there so that it makes sure one, only one bale at a time is injected into the chamber. After three are injected, the plunger pushes the stack of three backwards until you form a full set of 21 or seven by three. Overall, the system works really well and there's not a whole lot that goes wrong. Even when you're pushing the machine with multiple bales on the platform, the spacer bar does a good job of making sure it still only feeds one bale at a time. Got Donnie, which is Rob's brother, Don Pickworth on a baler. 
Wayne Pickworth, Carl Ryder, my mom, and Sammy from the Five Baylors, Jake from the Jitney, my dad and Robbie in the, uh, in the Barons. One more, it's about 4.30. We have another 50 acre field the Baylor's are about to jump over to. Shouldn't take them more than two and a half hours to bail. The pickup crew's right behind them. Uh, what's probably gonna take the longest is just unloading at the barn and trucking. But we got moisture coming Saturday night. We have all this hay down, we're gonna have to push, but it's dry and we're doing really well. We're making really beautiful hay. This is probably one of the last big pushes of the year, so you just suck it up and get it done. How's the Baron running for you, Dad? Oh my gosh, it's excellent. Everyone is right behind the balers. The cleanup crew, the bundlers. Working out the way it's supposed to. How fast are you able to run? I got it maxed out on my IVT on the low side, 12 and a half mile an hour. Right, yeah, okay. Is it? Yeah, but then it, you run into road gear. Yeah, then you gotta yeah. jump up the road gear. Well, the mirror, look at that, it's cracked. <laughs> yeah. Wonder how that happened. What are you basically looking at? Just, just, just making sure it's centered on there. Uh huh. And uh, then if we start pushing bales, we gotta slow up a little bit. But unless you're in one of the thicker rows, it, it, it really puts it away. This is making some hay. These are, these are real solid bales, and there's still yeah. a lot out there. We got Tom all loaded up. We are done with this side of the field. We can consolidate over there. The balers are about wrapping up. That is a nice, nice look of them. We pretty much have everything bundled in bundles of three. Jake's following a machine and I'm literally following a machine. So I'm gonna hop off, I'm gonna run a quick load home, see if we can make a uh, quick conversion on uh, another trailer, because we only have one trucker, and that'll speed things up a little bit. Jake, if the semi comes back before I get back, Jake's gonna hop in the telehandler and load the truck anyways. That's pretty darn nice hay, man. Ooh. Ooh wee get straps on this puppy and get out of here. Man, just look at this hay. Goodness grief. Besides the Spencer Bank barn, this might be one of the hardest barns that we stack. The driveway really needs blown out and made bigger, but we don't want to take up any more of the lawn. It's a tight door uh, for how long the telehandler ends up being with that grapple. And yeah, well, that's about it. swing out, not much clearance by the time he turns. Justin really excels. He has yet to hit the door. did make it back. We did exactly what we want. We rallied another trailer that otherwise wouldn't have happened. I probably wouldn't have been doing as much as I could have on the telehandler. Jake got this truck loaded, so we didn't fall behind. All the balers, we one-upped them with the preservative. They moved out of this field. They're in the other, I don't know, like 56 acre patch. And hopefully, yeah, we're gonna be waiting on trailers over here still, but everything's going well. Cleanup is always the slowest, so no big deal. Look at Carl, giving up on drinks. He is one of the nicest guys. He's always worried if you got drinks or food or whatever. It, that's great to have around. So for the first time in my life, we shut down at six. What time did we shut down, Carl? I don't know. I had never done that before in my life. What? Shut down before it was dark. The Baron is taking off, followed by the semi. Getting out of here. Excellent. 